What's up, CNC woodworkers? My name is Corbin Dunn, and this is my heart bowl. So it's Mother's Day, and I wanted to create a bowl for my stepmom, Karen, and my mother in law, Jeannie. I wanted to do the basic heart shape, but build off the last bowls I did, the epoxy drip bowls. Check out the video above for a link to those videos. So follow along and watch me make one of these bowls. It's drastically easier for me to start from a solid chunk of wood. I've had this large slab of old redwood laying around for a while and I decided to give it a go. Redwood is incredibly soft and I wasn't sure if it would hold the fragile bowl shape. I cut one chunk off and created a solid butterfly bowl as an experiment to see how well it would work and it did work quite well. Now this piece of redwood has a long history. It came from my parents' property in the Santa Cruz Mountains. They cut down some redwoods to build their house back in the early 1980s. 20 years later, I used this slab of redwood in my treehouse that I lived in for about five years. It was my kitchen countertop. The treehouse lasted about 10 years before it collapsed. I salvaged some of the pieces of wood and saved this chunk of redwood for another 20 years. Now it's moving on to its final life as a heart-shaped bowl. I made a few of these drip bowl styles and I realized a couple of things. First off, I don't need to make a mold if I machine it directly into the wood. Second, I can save a ton of epoxy if I only pour it where it is needed. Mm -hmm. 